Hello everyone in this video, I am going to show you the complete method of making organic compost using kitchen wastes. I will show you the whole A to Z process, so watch the video till end. Making organic nutrients in rich compost at home is not so hard. You can make organic compost with very little effort. There are many types of composts that is made from different components. In this video, I will make organic compost from the kitchen wastes, like the peels of vegetables and fruits etc. Some of the components like the milk products, meat, and bones etc. are not suitable for composting. So keep these things away from your composting bin. Here, I have the remains of peas, that I will use to make organic nutrients in rich compost. You can also use banana peels, eggshells, onion peels and the remains of potatoes and many other type of peels. The green remains like the leafy vegetables and the peels of green colored vegetables have so much nitrogen, that helps the plant to grow new leaves and branches. If you want to make the process of composting faster, then you can crush the peels into smaller pieces. It helps the microbacteria to decompose the material more efficiently. There are only few things that are required to the bacteria or other germs, to decompose the material, that are moisture, temperature, and aeration. I am using a 12 inches of clay pot, to decompose the peels. A clay pot have small pores that helps the air to enter in the soil, that is very much helpful to make the decomposition process more faster. You can also make compost under the ground and as a pile on the floor, but both of them have different methods. Make sure your clay pot or the composting bin have drainage holes at the bottom. For starting the process of composting, the moisture level is very important. First of all add 1 inch of soil at the bottom of the plant. If you don't add soil, it takes a long time to decompose the material. There are so many bacteria already present in the soil that starts the decomposition process. Make the layer of soil fully moist. I am repeating, that the water or moisture level is very much important to make the compost faster. Add a layer of peels or the material, that you are using to make the organic compost. Again add a layer of soil over the peels and then a small amount of compost. If you don't have compost, you can skip this element, but adding the compost layer helps the microbacteria to grow, and make the compost. In the same way, add a layer of peels then soil and then compost. Make the soil fully moist. And you have to keep this pot in a sunny place, you can also place it in the semi-shaded area, but the temperature or heat is also required to the bacteria. Make sure the soil is moist all the time. It usually takes about 40 to 45 days to complete the decomposition process. If you want to know how to make a liquid fertilizer using the compost, then check a link in the description below. After 50 days. Now I am sure the decomposition process is completed by the microorganisms. And the nutrients in rich compost is ready for our use. Brought the composted material out of the clay pot. As you can see, all the peels that we have added are not there. All of the peels converts into nutrients and dissolves in the soil. This is our harvested homemade organic compost, that is nutrients enrich and very beneficial for the plants. You can filter this composted material to separate the larger uncomposted parts, from the pure organic nutrients enrich compost. The color of my compost is little brownie, I think so it is due to the dryness. But it is a very good source of nutrients for every plant. You can add it in your all plants. A handful of compost in every 5 inches pot. You can use these larger pieces in your compost bin again. Making compost at home is very easy, you should must try out this method. You can store this compost in any poly bag to use it time to time. You can use this compost in your vegetable plants as well as flowering plants. And it is a purely organic fertilizer that is also very important for the health of your plants. For further updates from our channel, hit the subscribe button and also the bell icon to get notified. Thanks for watching.